Yes. Ah, oh, turn my kid into a patient. This is what I want. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today we're gonna react to Monami Frost's daughter, what she eats in a day. I know reacting to kids is really, really rough and many of you guys don't like to see malnourished vegan children. Guess what? Me neither. But it is really important to share this message, to spread awareness on this subject, because this is true child abuse. Let's do it. Hey guys, just before you watch hey. the new What My Vegan Daughter Eats in a Day video, I uh -huh. just wanted to quickly kind of come here and do kind a of. little disclaimer, because people have been jumping to conclusions and everything about my daughter's nutrition people mm -hmm. have been like doing videos Strange. about it uh, mm, on their really? youtube and that mm. is really really low of Why? people trying to pretty much gain followers and gain views ah. uh, by making a video about my daughter and Wait a second, so we are trying to gain followers and gain views through your daughter. Meanwhile, when we take a look at your channel, we see that the videos with your daughter are the most watched videos. You are directly capitalizing on your child. So how can you blame others reacting to it, especially if there is a real concern? And her nutrition. And mm. what I need to say is the food that my daughter eats is not every day the same. I don't know if you've seen... It doesn't matter if it is the same or not. It is vegan every day, I assume. And that is bad. Seen anyone really eat the same thing <clears throat> every single day? That is not the case for my daughter. I am sorry I don't mention it every single time in every video that she does. And also, we have never said anything... My daughter never said that like that is how you're supposed to eat and teaching anybody how to eat. But why do you show what your kid eats if there is no purpose behind it, right? So it is all about the money then. Those are the only two options. So you're either showing your child so you make money off her or you actually want to educate people. So which one is it? Vegan when you're a kid, we are just realistically showing what she is eating on some days when she's in yes, school and that is or bad. sometimes when she is in school mm -hmm. it is not like made a nutritious meal plan with everything yes but you are a mother shouldn't you be responsible for nutritious food hmm? uh, all the like needs wow. being made in one day because yeah crazy how could you meet all the needs in one day? Unbelievable, right? You could meet her needs with a little bit of eggs, a little bit of fish. Of course you cannot meet all those needs as a vegan. Realistically, that is not what Realistic. everybody does. And uh, kids eat McDonald's and exactly. eat candy. And yeah, of course. So if kids eat candy and McDonald's, then I can malnourish my children as well. And I can feed them vegan. Who cares, right? There are worse children out there. That shouldn't be the rationale of a mother. You should think about how to proper nourish your child, how to give it the best fuel. Sweets all day long. Like there are kids like that, oh. and then yeah, people, there are kids like, like that. Come at me about like feeding my daughter just food where there's so much nutrition compared to like. You have no idea what nutrition is in your food. Otherwise, you wouldn't be vegan. McDonald's food as well. Like I said, I want to be realistic and show. Just <laughs> I quickly take... What is realistic? Realistic by what? Measured by the standard of our society? That is realistic. If Cameron start filming like, oh yeah, today we're going to film something. We don't write down and make a meal plan for her, you know, on the day. Because like I said... No, you don't need a meal plan. You should provide nutritious food every day. That is your obligation as a mother. Not teaching anybody how to eat as a kid when you're vegan and... and okay, so you're not teaching, you're just capitalizing. Get it. What you should eat, it is just what she cool. is eating on some days and obviously she's eating such a variety of foods and she is taking vitamins like <sighs> in this video you'll see it's not food forget to plant life's matter part. 
and I'm sorry like I said we don't film the videos just to show you and teach others to what to do yeah Again, we get it you do it for the money that's okay this clear like I said you made it very clear very healthy and no she she's vegan so much good food and do you think you are in a healthy state we already seen your deterioration over the past years you are not healthy why do you impose your malnutrition onto your children that is the issue here i do not want to criticize kids i am criticizing you and you should be held responsible because you are marketing your daughter online people please do not try to examine my daughter's life oh yes but i will because you expose your daughter on the internet what do you expect and what my daughter is eating by one simple video where i haven't really created her meal plan every single day and get to the point it is all about Vegan what brain you fog. during Arr. a whole week during a month and yeah it's the most important thing and my daughter is if you know that it is the most important thing, why don't you provide food for your daughter? So freaking healthy. Vegans. So yeah. Thank you so uh. much. And let's watch what my daughter eats in a day. Hey guys, it's Gabriella Frost. And Hello, today Gabby. I'm gonna do another video of what uh. I eat in a day. Okay. So, yeah. Cool. This is my breakfast. It's just some okay dear gabby so in case you're watching again this video is not against you i would never attack children why would i they are not responsible for what they are eating it is the mother's fault so what do we see here we see a bunch of fruit nothing wrong with fruit but this is of course way too much why would you eat so much fruit I assume that this is not what you eat on a daily basis, but for this video, Monami decided to make it look super healthy because people believe fruits and vegetables super healthy. This is way too much sugar, man. 20 carbs from the apple, 10, 15 carbs from the blueberries, 20 carbs from the strawberries, and then the porridge and the nuts, the seeds. It's way too much sugar and way too much fiber, but way too little vitamin A vitamin d vitamin b12 and bioavailable protein you have none of those nutrients in this breakfast fruits oh, orange man. with chia seeds in like examine the stool of the child and you will see that the chia seeds come out again that is child abuse she is not digesting it there is no way in hell that a human being can digest chia seeds um Goji berries, uh, pumpkin seeds. Highly goitrogenic, super toxic. Some nuts. That's my breakfast for today. Not good. I'm nine years old and I have been vegan ever since I was four years old, so that's uncool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Cool would be something else. Cool would be proper nutrition. However, yet again, there are no vegan babies, of course. They all grow up on mother's milk. In her case, thank God, she got some nutrition as a toddler. Now, on the other hand, her mother is forcing malnutrition onto her. It has been some time after my breakfast, and now I'm gonna have a little snack. Um, Makes me almost cry, this stuff, time, really. And then Alpro is soy yogurt, phytoestrogen will disrupt her hormone balance, will disrupt her thyroid glands and again a piece of fruit with it because fruit healthy, this is what we know, right? I like the yogurt, but I'm gonna start with the uh. I really like clementines, like my favorite snack, like if I have fruit for snack, this is what I would take. Um, I love them because you are from some sort of Scandinavian country. Do you really believe that your ancestors would just gulp down on all of those fruits on a daily basis? Man, come on, use your brain if something is left, Monami. Really easy to peel and it just tastes nice. Makes me sad, really. No, 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 she's turning into a proper vegan. So good. This is what they all say, man. So I finished my home time. Now I'm gonna eat the Apro yogurt. Great the time. soy yogurt. Um, has super bad. Protein, but I don't really worry about it so much because 
I eat chickpeas all the time. So, nice. let's open this baby up. <laughs> there's like some layer, like a layer of yogurt, but then on the bottom there's some jam inside. I like to mix it, or uh, I like to mix it together. Soy it sugar, that's all. Nothing healthy, but you could give her real yogurt instead. Rich in probiotics, healthy. See the jam coming. Uh. Mixing together with yogurt. So good. So good. If you want to try one of these, if, and if you live in Liverpool or in the UK, I think, you can go to Tesco and buy some. Don't. So good. Hey so guys, good. it's lunchtime, and now I'm gonna have <sighs> more food now. Mm. And Poor this kid. looks amazing. Yeah, it's sure. Very yummy and tasty. Oh, Jesus Christ, what are we creating? A clone army of vegan zombies. This is what we see here. Yummy, tasty, so good, guys. Obviously, this is very staged. Her mother is recording this and she is going through the motions. Always the same. Yummy, delicious. This is what the vegan role models represent. And people are copying it to their own detriment. Man. And I'm drinking a lot of water. I'm Don't. having some potatoes, like cooked potatoes, cucumbers. Always tomatoes, tomatoes potatoes, potatoes, nightshades. Broccoli and mm -hmm. tempeh. Tempeh is slightly better digestible because it is fermented soy, still phytoestrogen latent. It will disrupt the hormones of this young child. It is child abuse so, let's eat. I love potatoes they're the best yeah. yeah I'm sure you do and again I cannot help but look at this dish and see it for what it is staged a staged what I eat in a day this is why we had that disclaimer in the beginning now you try to create healthy vegan foods right baked potatoes with vegetables and with protein on the side she's getting everything she needs bullshit this is still malnutrition when will you understand this a piece of tempeh ah. i like this it's supposed to be like maple bacon but yeah, soybeans. a meat replacement. I wanted to show you guys what, what else? I've been working on for, for like a few, few hours. I basically drew this elf thing I have. That's pretty. As a human. Cute. And, um, so I normally forget to film this, but I take vitamins. So oh. This is like a better human. Oh. Yes, ah, oh, turn my kid into a patient. This is what I want. I do not want to feed her eggs, no filthy meat. I want to give her sprays, pills, possibly injections. For what? Why do you force those chemicals onto your kid? What is the reasoning behind this? Vegan health daily oral uh, spray, uh, vitamin. Healthy oral spray. It is always the same. We're gonna write healthy onto the plastic container and we're gonna assume it is healthy. Of course, vegan brainwashing. Yeah, everything. Jesus then Christ. Omega 3 vitamin and DHA. Why don't you give the kid fish? Fish has all of this. And now I'm gonna have some Walker's brain chips. Yes, to wash it down. Salted. Some potato chips. Great, perfect snack. Awesome. Oh. So now Realistic. I'm gonna have my dinner. Oh. It's some rice, Never with ends. avocados, and then some chili that's not really chili. It's not spicy. <laughs> I feel so sorry for and you, kid. Some mushrooms in there, some veggie meatballs, be the kidney beans. So good. So good. Uh. Now I'm having my dessert. It's 
it's gonna be magnum ice cream. It's like Perfect. I think it's the almond one, so this is probably gonna be Perfect. the last thing I eat today. That um Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you Thank like you. this video. Give no. this video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Uh, <laughs> hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Little Frosted is out with ice cream. Alright. And this is it. Long enough. Frustrating enough. Saddening enough. If you made it through this video, I assume that you feel the same way. Absolutely frustrated with a foul taste in your mouth. It is absolutely horrific. Why do you do this to your children? It is just a trendy new movement. Do you understand that there are no vegan populations? Do you understand that this is a global scale experiment? Do you understand that you are destroying the future of your children with this malnourishment? This diet contains no bioavailable B12. Vitamin A, DHA, EPA, carnosine, carnitin, creatine, and whatnot. And this is why this young child sits there staring at a spray. Supplements are bad enough, but if you use them, you should use them as a supplement additional to your food. Vegans do not do that. Vegans replace their food by supplements. That is an issue that is alarming. This is not healthy. This is child abuse all right guys but this is it way too long if you like my reaction leave it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed already please do so guys if you want to support the channel all the links are in the description box below so we have amazon links for you you can head over there buy whatever you might want to buy and it doesn't cost you anything extra we get a small share that is a fantastic way to support bobby's perspective if you want grass-fed beef delivered to your doorstep butcher boxes for you and we have cbd links as well on top of that guys consider supporting bobby's perspective through subscribestar or patreon we have a vip community there where we have skype group calls every single week where we can discuss any topic no matter if it is health lifestyle or nutrition related on top of that by joining you straight away receive your comprehensive nutrition guide it is an ebook that teaches you the basics of nutrition but goes beyond as well and is catering to your personal goals no matter if you're keto primal paleo or even raw all right but this is it for today thank you very much for your support guys and as always much love and peace